The Internet of Things has introduced a wide array of devices that speak to the Internet. Unfortunately, many of these devices were never designed with security in mind. So you have medical devices in particular, insulin pumps, pacemakers, that do speak and communicate outbound to a network. And certainly if that's the case, you have hackers out there who are able to compromise those devices. So if you think about what an enterprising and malicious hacker could do with something like that, it's quite scary. You're talking about somebody with the ability to turn an insulin pump off, stop a pacemaker, wreak all kinds of havoc on an individual. And that's a very scary thought. Uh, certainly the other side of the, the, the coin here is you can have hackers that look to disrupt the actual delivery of care, meaning compromise an EMR, go after lab values, results, really look to make the organization's job of delivering care a nightmare by directly manipulating data. Uh, certainly possible, certainly feasible from a technology perspective. Of course, also, as devices get smaller, as we all rely on cell phones and the like to communicate as a part of our job, the foreseeable future would be that those devices become essentially an extension of the human being. They become implantable, wearable, um, and that certainly starts to ring some other alarm bells there. If you think through what could happen if your cell phone, um, your work phone, becomes embedded in you as a person, and what a hacker could do if they're able to compromise that device.